Four foot 11, huh? Try again, not the icebreaker you'd wanna go with. Do better. Keep being a little and I'm gonna come over and hide all your stuff on the top of the refrigerator. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to a brand spanking new video on my channel. Today we are looking at some Tinder nightmares. Are you guys on dating apps? Have you been on Tinder? It's horrible. <laughs> I've graduated from Tinder. I don't use Tinder anymore. I just sort of find that Tinder is sort of where all the where all the <laughs> boys live. It's where they live, it's where they thrive. It's where usually you hate being a woman. So I'm not on Tinder anymore. And once you watch this video, you're gonna understand why. On a scale from one to America, how free are you tonight? North Korea. Oh, oh, Bill. Mm. I think that's probably a no, Bill. Want to know what my second favorite dinosaur is? Try Sarah Tops. And what's your first? Try Sarah Topless. Ooh. Ooh. You got to give him credit. It's pretty good. Still no, though. Are you a turkey? No. Why? Well, you just look like you could use a good stuffing. Mm. Mm. Thank you. Hi, I just got out of prison and my parents changed the lock so I could really use a place to stay. You're cute, by the way. Well, sign me up. Sign me up, sir. Can't wait. Arr, I'm looking for some booty and plunder. Ew, what the f No eye patch jokes allowed? Okay. Oh, I get it. I just don't like pirates. You don't look like you hate pirates. I had a stroke and I have to wear an eye patch. I mean, at least she's wearing her eye patch in the photo though, so you know what you get, right? I just don't like pirates, okay? I don't. I'm sensitive about my eye patch. As you should be, girl. Are you really British? Guilty. I'm Indian. You enslaved my people. Discipline me the same way you disciplined my ancestors. Mm, okay. Are you from Japan? Cause I'm trying to get in Japan tees. No, I'm Finnish. Finnish with this conversation. That's what you get. Finish with this conversation. <laughs> I'm shopping at Petco tomorrow. Do you want leather or a sporty collar? Or we could just go straight to the vet and get you neutered. Blam! Pew, 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 pew. That's what I'm talking about. Mm. Did you fall from heaven? Because have sex with me. Sorry, didn't suffer a head injury during the fall. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Ooh, my adorable. We should have sex. How has that opener been working for you? Surprisingly bad. That's the thing, right? Like these guys with these really, really obvious openers, like these, like they just shoot their shot. I just, I wanna know, does it work? I mean, we're monkeys essentially. And when we, you know, try and get the peanut, we try different things to get the peanut, but then we don't get the peanut. Do we keep doing those things? So someone would have had to have accepted for them to keep wanting to get the peanut, the peanut being sex. You see what I mean? Someone has to be agreeing to this because it sure as fuck isn't me. You want it? Mm -hmm. Hey, I got in a small car accident last night. Good for you. Yeah, barely. Unfortunately, I hit a telephone pole and now the Polina little bit to the left. What? The pole leans a little bit to the left. Oh, it's because her name is Paulina. I like that. It's still a no though. <laughs> Did you buy your tickets yet to the gun show? What? No, for my public trial. I'm going to jail, LOL, for animal neglect. Because you don't eat them? For having these sick pythons? <laughs> it was a little roundabout way of getting there, but it's still funny. So why'd you swipe right on me? Hamburger pick won me over. Nice to meet you. Yeah, that would win me over too. He's awfully sunburned in that pic though. Guess I'm aloe for that boy. I'm from a small town. How tall are you? Six foot eight? Wow, you're pretty tall. Yeah, some girls like it, but it sucks because I have really long legs and arms and big feet, but tiny hands. So when I run, I look like a goblin sometimes. You there? No, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Why would you share this? He looks like a goblin when he runs. Same. I look like a T-Rex when I run. <laughs> I'm vegan too. No way. Yeah, that's why I swipe right. Ha ha, that's amazing. How long have you been vegan for? Started this conversation. <laughs> hey, he's already, he's already putting in the work. Y'all haven't even met yet. What did Scooby-Doo say when he spilled his drink? Mm. <gasps> Roopsie! Oh my god, I get it! 
Roopsy. Oh my god, because her name is Roopsy or his name is Roopsy. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm dead. Deceased. Hey, do you know what my grandpa said before he kicked the bucket? What did he say? I wonder how far I can kick this bucket. Bye. Okay, see ya. <laughs> I think that's cute. I mean, at least it wasn't nasty. At least it was just like awkward and funny. If you remove the D from your name, it's an anagram for the word Arkansas. That's a new one, LOL. So I guess the question at this point is, do you want the D? <laughs> hey, how funny that we matched. I didn't think I'd see you again. We've met? Haha, <laughs> do you not remember drunkenly walking into my dorm? No, I do not. When was this? Next weekend. Smooth. Smooth. That was smooth. Didn't see that one coming. You look sort of like a but in a good way. A good vibe. Oh wow, that's my cue to stop talking to you. Wow, James, you really know how to get them. Really know how to reel them in. You look like a but in a good way. <laughs> hey Garrett, how's your week going? Good, considering I got some awesome head last night. And yours? Cool. And you're already back on Tinder looking for some more, eh? Just right back on there. It's quality over quantity, Garrett. Garrett. My sister's name is Erica. I can't wait to say your name in bed. Oh my God, cause her name is Erica. Wow. Okay, that is a little Freudian. A little bit Sigmund Freudian, not gonna lie. Holy f I'd love to drink your bath water. Holy f I'd love for you to drink my bath water. That's disgusting. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, Belle Delphine. Hi, wanna see my dick? What if it's real small and will make you laugh? Wanna see my baby dick? No, not really. Do you want me to see your baby dick and laugh at your baby dick? Micro penis? What's the difference between me and my couch? I don't know what. My couch pulls out. I wasn't feeling well this morning, so I called my doctor and he said I should take more vitamin U. Oh, you just copied and pasted that, didn't you? I looked it up and there's actually like literal lists of Tinder openers that guys just like take and copy and paste them to as many girls as possible and like whoever responds responds. Hey, how was your weekend? I would totally let you take me to brunch tomorrow. This is so us, me doing all the talking and you sitting there looking all cute. So us, so us. I really feel like this is just, this is our relationship in a nutshell. Hey, the FBI is searching for my dick. Can I hide it inside you? I'm sure it's tough to find already. Burn! Oh shit! Oh my God! Oh my God! That was a good one. How you doing? Good. What's up? Not much, you. Sorry, my phone died. Oh my God, literally a year later. <laughs> November 10th, 2013, November 10th, 2014. Sure, your phone was dead for a year, Brett. Really? You're literally the most basic chick on Tinder. Have another pumpkin spice, whatever the Who hurt you? Someone just got dumped. You down to Correction, make love. Did you change it when she didn't respond? Oh, maybe I should try and make love. Maybe she'll be into that instead. We are. Still not into you though. Hey, wanna come for a bit? Sounds perfect. You could be my last before I leave the country. 400 East 56th Street, Tacoma, Washington. Feels like a trap. It's actually a police station. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna look at my local police station and just send it to the creeps. Go to this address. I wouldn't have told him. Why'd you tell him? Why didn't you just get him to go there? And he shows up at the police station. <laughs> Sorry, why are you on Tinder if you aren't looking for anything? As a joke, do people really meet on Tinder? I met my fiance on Tinder. Like, are you with your fiance still? Or like your ex fiance? Or like, you're just swingers? What's happening here? Oh, he's cheating, ah. You trying to get 4th of July today? Mm, I might have been if you didn't start with that. I just got out of jail, what's up? Not a lot, Blake, just not in jail uh and i guess you're not either anymore so i guess we have a lot in common we're both not in jail <laughs> great <laughs> just really scraping the bottom of the barrel boy plus girl plus beer plus wine minus pants minus dress minus bra equals then equals wet then peace pizza you want to go for pizza after all of that? I hope so. Are you paying? <laughs> Excuse me, miss, did you fart? What the f I was blown away. 
Yeah. Not a good way to start. I am confident, good kisser, and expert fondler. Sometimes funny. All I'm interested in today is making out and playing with boobs. You want to meet up? I have also showered, flossed, and brushed. I smelled lovely. You know, doesn't sound too bad of a proposition. Kind of want to know what he looks like. At least he cares about his hygiene. What? Damn. Sometimes it's hard to get a guy who even brushes his teeth. Why did the chicken cross the road? <laughs> Five days later. I like muff diving. <laughs> Shoot your shot, bro. Shoot your shot. If I were a giraffe, I would slam my enormous neck against all the other giraffes to establish dominance over the herd and then proceed to chat you up. I wouldn't mind if you farted during sex. <laughs> I like this guy, he's funny. Uh... <laughs> hey. Hey. How do you like your eggs in the morning? Unfertilized, preferably. Good point. I want to make mad passionate love to you on the beaches of Bora Bora, lather you in whipped cream and feed you berries. Light included. I feel like that's a surefire way to get kidnapped. You gotta be careful on these dating apps, man. There's some sickos, some freaky, freaky sickos. Will you marry me? Yeah, as long as you agree to pay off all my student loans. Last time that I downloaded Tinder, for that Tinder video that I did where I had blonde hair, there was a guy that literally opened every single conversation with, will you marry me? So obviously he did that for every single girl. I don't know if there's anybody dumb enough to buy it though. Clearly there, there had to have been. I do not know you very well, but I am down for a pizza that ass. Beautiful poem. I would definitely fuck you sober. Well, thank you. Oh my God, what a compliment. You don't need beer goggles to look at me? Wow. Wow. You're the one. Imagine telling your friends, he's like, so what's he like? Oh my God, it's amazing. He can actually like look at me while he's sober. It's amazing. Spit or swallow? Vomit. Mm. Your natural beauty radiates from my iPhone. I instantly acquired a tan from the warm heavenly glow. BRB applying aloe vera. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. That is lovely. Also, he has an iPhone. Those green texts, man. Surefire buzzkill. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, R, U, D, T, F with me. Look in between M and P and you'll get your answer. L, M, N, O, P. Oh, no. Ha! Ha! You got played, sir! Let's run away together. Oh, what a beautiful picture. That is creative. Well done. Mommy, I made you this emoji painting. Please have sex with me. Are oh the Gulf of Mexico? Because I want to drill you and make a huge mess, then refuse to clean it up and blame it on some other guy. Ho ho ho, I see what you did. Smart, very, very smart. Smart and political. He's a winner. And environmental as well. What has 50 teeth and holds back a monster? No clue, my zipper. Morning wood, wanna come over? Sure, I'll bring my hatchet. What? Yes, that's right, I got a hatchet. I got a hacksaw. <laughs> All right guys, that is it for this video. Tell me about your Tinder nightmares down below in the comments and as always, subscribe.